Corey, and you're watching Arrow Swinging TV. Hi, and this is Corey. Hey. You're watching Arrow Slinging TV. Today we're up here in the hill, Texas Hill Country at my new lease in Utopia, Texas. And we're going to show you around. We don't have four-wheel drive, so, so everything we bring has to go down, up, down, up, and all the way up to the top of this hill. All the two by fours for the blinds and all the corn, 50 pound sacks of corn going straight up a uh, 2,000 foot elevation hill. So, sack of corn at the time. This is the first time I've been on this lease, so hopefully, we'll get something. We have a lot of deer, a lot of hogs. Um, supposedly we have some axis deer and some uh, mouflon sheep. Uh, the axis come from, I think Asia. Very large mule deer sized deer, poke, uh, tan with polka dots. Big tall racks, beautiful deer. Uh, in the elk family, they bugle like an elk. And they cross these, these hills going to pasture. Hopefully we can get one of those. See what happens. Right here on Workout TV. I mean, Aero Slinging TV. <sighs> you can do it, Corey. We're almost there. Yeah. Just have to go to the top of that mountain. gotta want it but it is isolated it's great for bow hunting and, uh, here's the feeder kind of doing anything we can to keep the hogs from flipping it Lighter it is, the easier it is for them. Once they bump this thing and a little bit of corn flies out, then they really start hitting these legs. And uh, if it's not, you know, if it doesn't have a good bit of corn in it, and anchor down some kind of way, they will flip it and they'll just have a feast on the ground. So we don't want that. This is my tree stand. First of first of us, several tree stands we're gonna build. It's my recliner, tree recliner. Let's check it out. Yeah. Here. I just had two trees that were leaning nicely, so I decided to go ahead and uh, make a little recliner. See? This is the idea. I'll sit right here, leaning back in a recliner position, feet up. is the first bump feeder we've got so far and how it works is you just kind of bump it a little bit and some corn comes out and before we had it well we had to fix it a little bit because it was letting too much corn out so we put a couple sticks right here to keep it from a bunch of corn falling out it's dumping right yeah it's dumping <laughs> tell me about it Corey Here's the platform. I'm up top right now. The feeder right there. And this is gonna be great. Yeah, I can't wait till we get that backrest on there. 
we just kind of look at the trees and we bring in two by fours a saw and some hammer and nails and we just kind of custom make these stands fit to fit the environment Take a break from working on the blinds, and this is how we're going to cool off. <laughs>